everyone and welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be doing a DIY toy. So for this one we're going to need some paper muffin cups, some string, this is jute, and then this is just a piece of um, paper straw that I cut up just to put the bottom and then I'll use another piece at the top. But you'll see it turns into a nice um, puff ball that's really entertaining for birds. And even if you have a larger bird, it's still nice for them to have something that's easily destructible um, and it just gives them that satisfaction of destroying something quickly. But otherwise this is safe and enjoyable for birds of all sizes. So to get started, we're going to take out a lot of these papers and you will need quite a lot to turn this into a whole sphere shape puff but you can also just use less and then it doesn't turn into a sphere I don't know just depending on what you want the end result to be like <laughs> We're going to take scissors, kind of flatten it out a bit, and then every second one or every third little groove, you make a cut. The more cuts you do, the poofier this will be in the end. So there's one and let's just keep going. Okay, so I've got quite a couple of them cut. So now I'm gonna start putting it together. First just gonna get some string. I'm just taking about this much and then tie a knot in it for the bottom tie it like three times just so that it makes like a large knot that pieces can't fall off then I'm putting the little straw piece. Okay, so now I did cut all along the sides. Now we just need to make a cut in the middle, a little poke. And then push this through. There you go. So that one's facing down. Now the trick with this is alternating. So that one was facing down, and then the next one you need to put sort of facing up. Like that. And we'll do the next one. Be careful to not injure yourself using scissors. And if you are uh, a child rather have your parents or older sibling or guardian help you with scissors. So here you can kind of see how it's going to be this fun, poofy thing. OK, 
Okay, so the end of this thing keeps fraying. So I'm going to put some tape around it. And just roll it up so that I have a point. And it can stop being irritating and fraying. There we go. So here's the puff ball that I have right now. I can still add more if I want, or I can kind of leave it like this. I think I'm going to add some more to it. So now I'm done with this big puff. You can see it'll be lots of fun, and you can actually stick little treats in there for your parrot to forage for. So to tie this off, I'm going to take a piece of straw. Put that in, pull it tight, and then make a knot. So there we go. Uh, I've still got some, you know, string left here. So I can put some other things on top. This is just um, from egg cartons. I'm just going to put in just a couple like that. And then I'm going to make a little knot. So yeah, I've got a little loop to put a clip on and hang it to the side of the cage. And there's our little puff toy or any bird of any size to enjoy and this is something relatively cheap that you can make you know times are tough and buying toys especially from a pet store those ones are particularly expensive but this is something fun that you can do at home I bought um, this container of the muffin cups there's a hundred in for 23 Rand and I didn't use all of them so you know that's less than 23 rand i got the pack of paper straws for 12 rand this jute string was 15 rand and obviously the cardboard egg boxes just have at home from having eggs so yeah it's an inexpensive way to create toys for your birds so thank you all so much for watching please like this video if you found it helpful and interesting and subscribe to our YouTube channel so that you can stay updated when we post new content. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!